Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Aarti Hooja, your life coach and an entrepreneur coach. And you're watching my show, Hustler's Life. budding entrepreneur or you want to start something of your own this video is for you as promised today we will be discussing frameworks of ideation idea is one of the most important factor for the success of the business now what is a good business idea where does ideas come from ideas are not just flashes of insights they grow and they evolve today we are going to discuss seven frameworks for ideation defragmenting disintermediation utilizing underutilized resources bridging supply and demand new combination fast followers and clones and global success your idea should focus on solving customers problem so what is important is to find a good problem and then a good solution so let us look at these frameworks of ideation so the first one is defragmenting which means positioning and organizing things in one place for example zomato it was started by two iitians they were standing in long queues to order their food for lunch so what they decided they scanned the menus and put it on a website which was called as a foodie bay later on this idea evolved and they changed the name to zomato now zomato is one of the leading food tech platforms The second framework of ideation is called as disintermediation. Uber is a perfect example of this, which means eliminating of unnecessary steps. Now, before Uber also people used to hire cabs, but Uber made it very convenient to hire a cab just using a smartphone and lot of features. So it eliminated lot of unnecessary processes. The third framework for ideation is utilizing the underutilized. A good way to explain this is an example of a startup called as Airbnb. So one of the founder Brian Chesky was finding it very difficult to pay his rents. So he had rented a house in which one room was vacant. So he rented it out to pay his bills and that was the idea of Airbnb. So he utilized a unutilized room to generate the cash flow. The fourth framework of ideation is bridging the gap between supply and demand. A beautiful example to explain this is chai point. In India, 80% of the population prefers tea over coffee. But there was a time when people were opening coffee chains after coffee chains. Amleek Singh thought of the idea of chai point and it really became a success because there was a need but there was no supply. So demand was there, supply was not there. The fifth framework for ideation is new combinations. To explain this the biggest example is of the apple industry called as a style cracker box. Now what they do they get a dress according to your body type what will suit you there is a stylist and also they will buy accessories which will be matching to that particular outfit. So it saves the headache of the customer to going n number of places. The sixth framework for ideation is called as fast followers and clones. Google and Facebook is a beautiful example of this particular framework. Google was not the first search engine, yet a huge success. The seventh framework for ideation is called as global success. Any product which is successful globally, that idea can be brought into the Indian market. To explain you this, a perfect example is about the vegan industry. Many people have been successful in in the Indian economy. using this particular idea which they borrowed from the global market so these are the seven frameworks for ideation remember framework is just the base for the ideation your idea needs to be unique and original i hope you like this video for more such content please subscribe to my channel stay tuned god bless you all and have a great day thank you so much